Hi all, this is Steve Miley, the market chartist on behalf of forextraders.com and we're now looking at both the euro versus the US dollar and the US dollar versus Japanese yen. So looking at the US currency within the G3 complex, within the euro, US dollar, Japanese yen complex and looking at a more negative tone for that US currency um, emerging again as we go through into the middle and latter part of March. Um, critically was been the shift in euro dollar with this whipsaw price action. We had that initial rally back here in early February which we have given up a lot of and switched us back to a more um, neutral theme with a breakdown through this trendline support but then the rebound um, going into the ECB meeting and the extremely erratic um, session we had through the ECB on Thursday which probed down at support but held key supports down here at 107.77 107.08 and then the solid rebound back up through 111.57 re-energizing a more bullish theme in here and bigger picture we're looking for targets up here at 113.76 113.95 114.95 through mid-March into the second half of the month. If we take a look at dollar yen, more of a sideways consolidation theme really, but repeated rebound efforts have failed ahead of this key 114.88 level. And whilst below there, the market's rejecting, avoiding a more neutral tone in here. That's a potential double bottom rejecting that double bottom leaving bearish pressures from the whole sell-off here from late December through January and more importantly it's accelerated sell-off through February and the downturn we, we saw again in late February all of this whilst below 114.88 leaves a more bearish tone for dollar yen so dollar looking weak versus the yen and increasingly weak again versus the euro this has been Steve Meyer the market chartist on behalf of forextraders.com and I wish you a great trading week